new restaurant is officially open for business in our area. The Triad's first African food truck, African Avenue, celebrated its grand opening over the weekend. And you can now visit them at Haynes Mall in Winston-Salem. So I'm really excited to learn more about this from the owner herself of African Avenue, Rokia Tankara. Thank you so much for joining us this morning. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. So first of all, congratulations. This yes. is very exciting for you, I'm sure. What inspired you to create African Avenue and bring this to the triad? Yeah, so I'm actually an alumni from um, Salem College. I graduated in 2018 with a degree in communications. So I moved back to New York and recently I moved back to Winston and I'm like, there's no African food. So me and my business partner decided to open up African Avenue. I love that you saw a need and were yeah, immediately like, yeah. well, I can fill this, <laughs> amazing. So which African countries are represented uh, by your menu and, and what kind of items do you serve? Yeah, so the um, cuisine that we sell is um, Nigerian based. Um, so the chef is actually, his name is Ridwan Abbas. He's from Nigeria, born and raised. So he's the one cooking all the Nigerian dishes from a goosey to pound of yam um, and jollof rice. How about some favorites? Can you tell us maybe some that you love yeah. the most? Yeah, so my favorite is the shawarma wrap. Um, it's like a chicken wrap and we have condensed milk. It's like our secret um, sauce. Um, I also like the fried fish with plantains on the side, but everything on the menu, I'll say, is it's, it's something to try. Yeah, I was gonna say, I'm sure that you have to approve every single dish, sauce, everything. Yeah. So it's gotten your stamp of approval. How does it feel knowing that you were making this type of cuisine more accessible in this area. You were saying, you know, you were trying to find this in, in this area. Why do you think it, it was not accessible for and, and how does it feel making that kind of come true? Yeah, so during my time here in college, um, I always, we always had to like travel to Charlotte or Greensboro to, to access African food. So, you know, that's gas money and just, you always have to plan a trip somewhere else. So we're like, this is something we really need in Winston-Salem where people don't have to drive far, where they just, you know, pull up to Haynes Mall, a central location where they can access African food whenever they want. That is really cool. So I have a very specific question. If somebody <laughs> has never had Nigerian food, what would be the perfect order? It can be a couple of different items. What would you recommend for somebody's first experience there? So they get a whole taste of everything, yeah. yeah. For your first experience, I'll start with the jollof rice with chicken or goat meat and a side of plantains. Um, we also have fried rice too. So jollof rice has a little bit of spice. So if you're if you're not used to like spices, I'll start with fried rice as well. But jollof rice is the first thing I recommend for people. That okay. So good. That does sound good. Yeah, we're seeing pictures of some of this food, yeah. and I already was hungry, and now I'm especially starving. <laughs> um, but uh, Rokia, another question for you: When you were coming up with this menu, you were talking about maybe you know approving the different dishes. What was that like working with that chef? You were saying born and raised in Nigeria. Were you uh, a part of those kinds of decisions as well? Did you use any of your own maybe family experiences or recipes? Uh, so um, I will say one thing. Well, I'm Malian American, okay. um, so I kind of have a touch of Africa. So I, the only thing I kind of put in the menu is the bisab drink. So it's like a fruit punch drink um, that people really like. But other than that, the chef Ridwan Abbas, he's the one that came up with the menu. Um, he has all the authentic um, recipes and ingredients. So he's the one that kind of um, structured the menu. Okay. So you had your grand opening over the weekend. We're showing some video. It looked like it was a long line. How was it? It was it was amazing. It, we were shocked. The response <laughs> that we got, people were just pulling up. The line was long. It was it was great. It was amazing. Well, like you said, people used to have to travel really far for this kind of food, so now it's in their own backyard, which yeah. is really cool. Awesome. So we know yeah. that you are open Tuesdays through Sundays from 11 until 8 at Haynes Mall. Any um, Parting thoughts before we say goodbye? Do we still have her? Yeah, I'm still here. Um, yeah, I just stopped by and have a taste of Africa. We're excited to meet you all at Haynes Mall. Well, we